Prior to its launch later this year, Porsche is doing lots of testing on the coming second-generation 992 Series 911. The second-gen upgrade will bring updates to its powertrain, as with all contemporary 911s, as well as technological advancements and a subtle stylistic refresh. Additionally, a hybrid powertrain is coming to Porsche 911 for the first time. Due to the 992.2 being built from the ground up to be compatible with an electrified powertrain, the hybrid system will be integrated into the current flat 6 engine. Prior to the debut of the 992, the original plan for an electric 911 was shelved, but Porsche has chosen to revive the idea for the midlife update of the car. Instead of going the plug-in route, Porsche will utilize mild hybrid technology. Experts predict that the electric motor will be included in the 8-speed PDK dual-clutch transmission, and the battery will likely be mounted either in front of the 6-cylinder boxer engine or between the front firewall and the front cargo area. They predict that the battery will likely be small and operate on a 400-volt electrical system for simplicity. However, they warn that the 992 shouldn't be misled by the hybrid powertrain. Current 3.7-liter twin-turbo boxer engine in the Turbo S can produce 640 horsepower and 800 newton meters, 590 pound-feet, of torque, making it one of the most potent and torque-rich 911s in the lineup. There are rumors that the hybridized Turbo S will be able to reach 800 horsepower. That would be plenty. Or as the Turbo is rumored to be called the Porsche 911 Turbo E Hybrid. Will the Turbo S version then be called Porsche 911 Turbo E Hybrid S? We will see. The 992 generation 911 lineup's most potent and desired versions will continue to be the Turbo and Turbo S. The GT2 is a hybrid of the GT3 and Turbo models, and in addition to the Turbo and Turbo S, it is renowned for its performance on the racetrack and its lightweight construction. In addition to the twin turbo 3-liter boxer and the naturally aspirated 4-liter found in the GT3 and GT3 RS models, Porsche offers two other engines in the 992 generation 911 lineup. Each engine has its own special performance capabilities, but the Turbo and Turbo S continue to rule the highways. However, what about the opposition? Despite the fact that there are other hypercars on the market today, only a select few can compare to the Porsche 911 in terms of performance, style, and exclusivity. With the addition of a hybrid powertrain, the Porsche 992.2 Turbo S is also a step toward Porsche's commitment to sustainability. The hybrid powertrain is expected to increase fuel efficiency and reduce emissions, making it a more environmentally friendly option for car enthusiasts who crave performance. Traditional mid-life cycle upgrades will be made, and front and rear bumper designs will change to fit the hybrid system's cooling needs. Additionally, new LED headlights, see Cayenne 2024 video on this channel, and tail lights will make their debut. Bolder design modifications will be necessary around the engine cover, once again to help cooling, necessitating design adjustments for the current single-piece light bar. In conclusion, the Porsche 992.2911 is a perfect illustration of why Porsche has maintained its leadership position in the sports car market for more than 50 years with its iconic design, unmistakable from any distance, 